A day after a startling U.S. commando attack inside Syria, the Bush administration remains tight-lipped about the operation. White House Press Secretary Dana Perino is offering no comment, and the State Department only had this to say. It's a tough fight, certainly a uh, tough um, uh, ideological struggle, uh, the fight with violent extremists. And like I said, you have to, uh, you, you have to come at the problem on a variety, across a variety of different fronts. The Syrian government puts the number of dead at eight, including four children. But that conflicts with the accounts of local officials and an AP journalist at the funerals who saw the bodies of seven men and no children. A U.S. military official says the attack was targeting the network of al-Qaeda-linked foreign fighters moving through Syria to help fight in the war in Iraq. The helicopter raid echoes a similar one conducted in Pakistan last month. Some experts are questioning the U.S. strategy. We're taking a short-term initiative that seems to be rewarding, but it probably undermines what we want to do in the longer term. Frederick Barton is a senior advisor in the International Security Program at the Center for Strategic and International Studies. It will probably cause us more backlash than we will get, have gained from the, from the individual uh, action. Um, that's why we have to measure these things much, much more wisely. <laughs> Some of the dead are being buried Monday, and angry residents are protesting the American action. The raid has also been condemned by Syria, Iran, and Russia. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.